Now, last week, Citizen TV ran an eye-opening feature called Garbage Rivers in Nairobi. It showed images which showed the deplorable state of some of our main water bodies and the environmental and health risks they pose. On Her Say Tonight, we highlight the story of a woman who started a company to address that danger. Lucy Wanjiku is a water engineer who recycles wastewater into a reusable resource. And here is her story. So here is the real stuff. Vicky might collapse. <laughs> it's a stinky job, but someone's got to do it. For Lucy Wanjiku, waste has become a common sight in her job. She's a water engineer who started a company that uses German technology to recycle wastewater and turn it into a reusable resource for household use and even watering the grass. The shocking fact is that whatever we call seaweed is 95% water. So if we just eliminate the 5%, that's the harmful bit, we get back 95% as water. And this water is good for lawns. People like Kenya Power would have a place where maybe we can recycle the massive volumes of sewage and use it to generate electricity. Lucy and her colleague Emmanuel are on a routine spot check at one of their clients' homes where they installed one of the systems supplied by her company, EcoCycle Limited. For the last five years, Lucy's company has been offering this service to its now over 100 clients. Our capital investment looks high, but when you look at what you're already spending to call the honey sucker to come and fetch out, like if one truck costs 10,000 and every month you're calling a truck, that's already 120,000. And in three years, you've already spent the same money that I would ask you to fix our system. And the benefit of ours would be you have green lawns throughout the year, you, you reduce your water intake if you take it back to flush toilets, so you cut down on your water intake by about 30%. Lucy specializes in on-site wastewater treatment and recycling for reuse technology. With experience of over 13 years in the automotive sector and the environmental engineering solutions sector. It's a journey she's happy she started after visiting Germany to see this technology in action. I've been lucky enough to have uh, international trainings on the soft skills side. Of, in Germany, I had a lot on international leadership, uh, project management. I've been to the U.S. again on the pitching side. So I try to do the same knowledge I have gained. I do in-house transfer and then at least the job is more exciting. With about 30% of Kenya connected to the municipal sewerage system, Lucy has seen that challenge as an opportunity to cover the remaining 70% of the country with more systems like this. I would love to have a local setup where we are assembling the stuff here and we reduce the importation. And then uh, one thing that we focus to work on is um, we are trying to cover the whole of Kenya. So as at the moment, I think we have like an installation at least at, in about 14 or 12 counties. So within the next two to three years, uh, my dream is that every county has at least like one installation. So when we are selling to someone in Busia or in Mombasa or in Mandera, we don't have to bring them to Nairobi to come and see how it works. Because when we are selling, seeing is believing and it makes the uh, embracing of the concept very easy. Lucy hopes more Kenyans will embrace this new concept to safeguard their health and the environment against risks that could cause irreparable damage down the line.